it's reading time with Steffi. Today's book is How to Catch a Dinosaur, written by Adam Wallace and Andy Eckleton. Please subscribe to my channel as I'm adding new books each week. And if you enjoyed this video, please go and give it a like. Tomorrow's the big science fair. I've never won before, but this year I know I cannot lose because I'm catching a dinosaur. The crocs and the sharks we know today were here when the dinosaurs ruled. It makes no sense all dinos are gone. On this point, I cannot be fooled. We head straight to our local park to pick up some kind of trail. Wait, what's that over there? Yes, I think it's a dinosaur tail. The dino is more bird than reptile. We learned in science class that's true. And this one left something behind. I've got our first dinosaur clue. Looks like we've got a plant eater. The Venus flytrap had no chance. She danced right by our volcano and knew the exit at first glance. Was she watching when I tested each trap with my action figures and toy bricks? It's like she knows how each trap works. Can it be she's onto my tricks? Well, that didn't go according to plan. She slipped right past our noses. And if that isn't bad enough, I ruined Mum's prize winning roses. We made a prehistoric playground with lots of friends to play. Our dino won't be able to resist. This time she won't get away. Tall enough to stop a giant. Our trap has pulleys, ropes and decks. But this dino smashed it all to pieces. She should be called T-Rex. My mom is an engineer, so I've learned a trick or three. Our Robo Hugger 9000 won't let our dino go free. That clever dino tricked our robot by dressing like a bird. If I don't catch the dinosaur soon, I'll be lucky to come in third. We didn't catch the dinosaur. I don't know what to do. But my friends reminded me we still have a science fair entry or two. We did it! Better luck next time.